Hi, Mary from Reviewer's Diary. I have <laughs> an Alta haul. <laughs> I bought enough Alta products to again get another one of these bags. Anytime there's a fabulous special like this where you can get free stuff, I mean totally free, I always take advantage of it because then later I can use the cosmetics and I don't have to buy them again. I had to buy um, $20 worth of products which was really really easy to do. Well first off, I use brushes all the time. In fact I have quite a collection and I have some really good Ooh, this is wet all over. I'll be right back. All right, so now we know why they package things like this in a separate bag all by themselves. So I got brush cleaner. Really needed something like this. This is apparently better to use than submerging your brushes because let me take out my most recent recent acquisition. Love this brush. This is a real technique setting brush. Apparently if you put it in a tub of soapy water, some of the water will get down into this bezel. I guess I think that's what they called it. And it can loosen the glue that holds your brush together. Um, so apparently it's better to hold it this way and spray it and clean it that way. We'll see how that works because I'm no expert. I'm not a makeup artist, but something that I'm going to try. I'll start using this tomorrow. One of the other things I got was this um, Hydra Quench Foaming Oil Cleanser. Now I like oils of all kinds um, and I've been using Garnier um, oil but it's not cruelty free. Ulta Cosmetics are cruelty free. not tested on animals. <clears throat> so Ulta is cruelty free and apparently their cleanser is also cruelty free. Apparently this oil <clears throat> rubbed all over emulsifies into a foam and rinses off when you combine it with water. So this is exactly the kind of stuff that I absolutely love. So I will definitely review this, and if I like this, I'll be buying this for a long time. Finally, these dark circles are horrific. <laughs> and I'm not wearing IT um, Cosmetics right now. Right now I'm wearing Elizabeth Arden Foundation, but I have the IT Cosmetics Foundation. It's actually a CC cream, but it's so thick that it might as well just say foundation on the tube. So what did I get? The under eye cover to match that. Um, it comes in this neat tube and it has an applicator tip. I have an eye cream that's got one of these things and what I found was <clears throat> it didn't really feel right. <laughs> so what I started to do was squeeze a little bit and then dot it on my both of my eyes. Probably the same tactic I'm going to use with this because I just can't imagine that this little metal thing is going to, you know, do very much. This is 50 SPF, which is astounding and fabulous. Um, so I will definitely use this and do a review. In fact, I believe what I'm going to do next Probably the next video will be the CC cream and the CC eye cream. So you'll see me once again with my dark circle showing and looking exhausted, but I think it's worth it to show you guys exactly how these things work. So this is absolutely fabulous. Cleanser is absolutely fabulous. And the brush cleaner absolutely fabulous. I am so happy with my purchases. This is why I never use this return thing. And I also got samples. Now I got a Smashbox. I'll hold it up so you can see it a lot better than I can, but it's a primer. Unfortunately, Smashbox is not cruelty free. 
So even if I like this, and I will try it because it exists in the time-space continuum of my house. So I will try it and I might do a first impression on it, but I won't buy it. I just can't do it. If I got two other samples, okay. Lumine BB Serum. I think this stuff might be cruelty free, I'm not sure, but we'll try this and see. Also, an IT, it Cosmetics, and it looks like it's a slightly darker shade, certainly, definitely, fabulously worth trying. And for those who have not seen what comes in these bags, um, I have another video where I have the other bag, which is a little bit prettier. Maybe. Depends if you really love pink. The other one I have is in like a uh, lilac color. Um, one of the shadows inside was broken. So let's see if that's the case again. Now, of course, now if you haven't seen my other video, I'm going to re-unpackage this just like as if you had no idea what's in here. It's all Ulta Cosmetics, by the way, which are cruelty free, and I really like the performance. Very nice thing. Again, I've got this package wrapped in tissue. And I see, it. I don't see anything broken. <laughs> And it comes in this pouch. And of course, it's got the $5 coupon. I use these all the time. And it has the full size mascara in there and lip products. And I'm going to take everything out so I can show you, but I'm going to do it really quickly because I've done this before. Whew! It took a lot of uh, work to get that out of there. My battery is acting like it's going to die, and so therefore I am going to do this quickly. It comes with a set of brushes, actually one, two brushes and one sponge applicator. They're not bad, but they're not really high quality. The brushes are not very nice, but still, to throw them in my purse, um, not a bad thing. It came with, actually love this green. Um, this is nice colors. This blue and black. Love that. And actually these have names. One is called Natural. Um, one is called Smoky. And the one that was broken in the other set, I mean it was like the cover was the color of this dark. Uh, you couldn't even see through it. Um, this one is called Romantic. And these are really beautiful colors. Very nice. This is also an eyeshadow. It's a loose um, powder shadow, uh, and it is a silvery color. Um, it also has a blush and a bronzer. Nice thing is you can swirl a brush through the middle of that and just kind of give yourself a little bit of peachy color. Um, or you can be really careful and just do a little um, this is a dual-ended pencil, and even though they both look black, one of them is brown and the other one is black. Very handy. Gotta love it. I have my, of course it won't compare to Tarte. I have my Tarte pencil. I use that every day. <clears throat> have that on right now. Um, it came with a full Amped Lashes mascara, full size. I've never used it, so it'll be good to try. Came with a neat little lip gloss. A lip crayon, which is kind of peachy color, which may need a little top coat of something pink. Um, and huh, an eyebrow kit. This might be what you use some of those little thin brushes with. <clears throat> and finally, the last thing that's in there is a little nail polish. But there it is. Now I have two of these same color. <laughs> so there are the products. Now for a $20 purchase of products that I would have bought anyway, I got this bag of free stuff. Um, this is the star of the show. <laughs> this was not cheap. It cosmetics, not cheap. Um, but the 
higher end brands are not cheap. So I looked at Tarte, I looked at a couple of different brands and I decided to do this one since I do tend to wear the IT CC cream more often than anything else. So I will do a test drive on this and I may do it on film. Thank you. This has been Mary from Reviewer's Diary. Thank you for watching and I hope you got something out of this and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you'll come back for more. Thank you for watching. Have a beautiful evening.